Laverne Donalyn Spencer, athlete extraordinaire, national sports icon, a name synonymous with women's high jump throughout the wider region and the world. Laverne's journey as a high jumper started just one year after entering the Entrepot Secondary School when Mr. Gregory Lubin, her physical education teacher at the time, saw something in her that led him to introduce her to the sport of high jump. This decision turned out to be a masterstroke because less than a year later, Laverne Spencer had broken not just the school's record, but St. Lucia's national record. From there, she never looked back as she went on to dominate the sport of women's high jump in St. Lucia, setting record after record. In fact, she became so dominant in that field that she had to, on occasions, compete against the boys. And there, she did better than just hold her own. By the time she graduated from secondary school and moved to the South Lewis Community College, Laverne was in a league of her own. She had by then won St. Lucia's Junior Sportswoman of the Year four times and the Sportswoman of the Year title three times. She was a Pan Am Juniors medalist and character medalist. It therefore came as no surprise when after just one year at the Sir Arthur Lewis Community College, she made the decision to accept one of the many offers of a full scholarship that she had received to attend university in the United States of America. Fortunately for the star high jumper, assistance in making that decision was not too far away as she had from her early years found a mentor in the person of her present local manager, Mr. Gregory Dixon, who has been with her throughout the entire journey. He was at the time her church youth leader and assisted her greatly in dealing with the pressures that came with balancing academics and sports and having to face the public with her newfound fame. He didn't just guide her into making the right decision in terms of a U.S. college, but he mentored and counseled her throughout that rough four-year journey at Albany State University and the University of Georgia, and was there to ensure that upon graduation, she signed a professional contract with Stella Athletics, making her St. Lucia's first full-time professional athlete. <music> It was also a divine blessing for Laverne to have been born into a Christian family, for they have given her tremendous support throughout her career, spiritual and otherwise, particularly her mother, Anne-Marie Spencer, who has always been a tower of strength in time of need, especially through her prayers. The role of the Baptist community, especially her home church, Gospel Baptist Church of Babano, cannot be overstated as they have contributed greatly in many ways. They too have been very consistent with their prayers and support. This year marks 20 consecutive years that Laverne Spencer has been representing St. Lucia all over the world and her list of achievements during that period is nothing short of phenomenal. She is indeed a track and field pioneer in St. Lucia, becoming the first to win an international medal, the first to become a full-time professional athlete, the first to qualify for the World Championships, the first to make it to the finals of the World Championships, the first to qualify for the finals of the Olympics, the first to compete in the prestigious Diamond League, the first to medal at a Diamond League competition, the first to be selected for the Continental Cup, the first to medal at the Continental Cup. Laverne is a true champion, having worked her way to becoming character champion, six times Central America and the Caribbean Championship champion, three times Central America and the Caribbean Games champion, North and Central America and the Caribbean under 23 champion, three times North and Central America and the Caribbean Games champion, 
Southeast Conference Champion, Pan American Games Champion, Diamond League Champion, Commonwealth Games Champion. Laverne is a multiple record holder. She is St. Lucia's national record holder, the Windward Island School Games record holder, CARICOM record holder, CAC Championship record holder, NACAC Championship record holder, Albany State University record holder, University of Georgia record holder. Undoubtedly, this daughter of the soil is the most decorated athlete St. Lucia has ever produced, having won 15 Sportswoman of the Year titles. So it was therefore a much deserved recognition for her when in 2015 she received the Medal of Merit Gold from the Governor General for her contribution to sports in St. Lucia. Vern Spencer of St. Lucia is in the gold medal position. Five-time Central American and Caribbean champion, two-time Commonwealth Games bronze medalist. A big season on the Diamond League this year. Fifth in Doha, third in Beijing, third in New York. Steadies herself here for her third and final attempt at 194. Oh, she's got it! What a big jump! That puts a real firm grip on the gold medal right there. Makes it look casual. That is technique. That is timing. That is perfection for Laverne right now. She has decided that she will not continue and she will retire at 194 as the gold medal Pan American Games champion. But probably the crowning moment in her illustrious career to date was when in 2018, Almost at the point of her 20th year of national representation and St. Lucia's 40th anniversary of independence, she again created history when she won the Commonwealth Gold Medal in Australia, making her the first St. Lucian to win a gold medal at this event. Laverne Spencer is no doubt in the twilight of her career. But her achievements and level of success will always be a permanent fixture on the hearts and minds of all St. Lucians. It is becoming increasingly difficult for this veteran high jumper to maintain the same level of success. But after 20 years of representing her country, she continues to set lofty goals and reach for the stars. For the sky is the limit. Happy 20th anniversary, Laverne.